It's your boy Sid and welcome to the Dallas Cowboys for Life channel. I want to thank everyone who's taking the time to subscribe and view my videos and if you haven't clicked that subscribe button below, please do so. And please don't forget to click my new Facebook channel. Go follow it. All my content will be on there and I'll be having multiple discussions with all the Facebook followers as well as the YouTube followers on my channel. So please be sure to check that out. So as you notice, I did a video yesterday and I've decided to do a video again today because the Jamal Adams situation is blowing up. Um, and I have to definitely touch a little bit on this. I'm a little bothered and I'm gonna touch on the NFL, I'm gonna touch on Dak a little bit and I'm gonna definitely discuss Jamal Adams. Now guys, as you know, Jamal Adams has basically, there was a, an announcement made yesterday that he approached the team and he's requesting to be traded and requesting to go out there and um, start shopping around. Now the Jets have not officially given him permission, but it's out there that he definitely doesn't want to continue playing for the Jets and that um, he, sh you know, a lot of people are saying that he will not be in a Jets uniform going into the season. I don't know about that. Um, listen, there's no teams out there right now that are making any big moves. And I don't know if you guys notice this because Dak is not getting what he's asking for. Um, there's no moves being being uh, being made there, and it's dragging out. Uh, Jamal Adams now his his contract negotiation is being dragged out, and it's gone to the point where he's requesting to be traded. Um, it's sad, and I have to say, I think there's more behind the scenes going on than what we're being told. Uh, we don't even know if there's going to be an NFL season. Now, if I'm an owner. And the guys, again, everything I say on my channel is my opinion and my opinion only. If I'm an owner and I don't even know if there's an NFL season going to be happening, am I going to be making any big moves right now? And that's exactly what I think is the issue that's going on in the NFL across the board right now. Because no big moves are being made. No contracts are being signed. No, there's nothing being done. And I believe that because of the fact that we don't know if there's going to be an NFL season, and like I said yesterday in my channel, the NFL has to put the right protocols in place for the training camps, the training camps that happen. And then, you know, there's rumors going around about how there's these new helmets that are going to come out. And guys, it's all hypothetical and it's all rumor based. So we don't even know what's going on. Now, with the whole Jamal Adams situation, I believe that he's one, he's asking for too much. Two, um, I don't think he's going to be worth the rumors that are out there that uh, we, the Dallas Cowboys are going to give him first, third, and a player. And I think he's asking for something like 18, 18 mil. Now, if we were to do this move before signing Dak, do you guys actually think Dak would want to be showing up to training camp if his contract is not even done yet? I don't think so. And I think that signing Jamal Adams right now will be a bad move for the Dallas Cowboys. Um, I think if we're gonna, if we were to make that move, we definitely gotta sign Dak first. We gotta take care of him. And it's, guys, it's 30 days. We're we're 30 days away from July 15th uh, to make sure that we get Dak secured and his contract being done. And I, as I said it before, and I, I'm gonna say it now again, I think Dak's contract is definitely gonna be done before July 15th. Now, I wanna know your guys' opinions. Please, please comment below. Do you think that, um, you know, going after Jamal Adams before we sign Dak is the right move? Do you think that we should give up all these, you know, like I said, it's all hypothetical first, third, and a player, or what do you guys think Jamal Adams is worth? Leave your comments below. Guys, thank you again for taking the time to tune in. It's your boy, Sid, and I'm out.